promised me before? Yes, I remember. You want me to write you a new note. But the thing is, I didn't even write you the last one. Don't worry. We'll help you again. Dearest Maricia, you are so extreme. <laughs> and almost as popular as Myra. Oh, 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 And the oh. Eric's rule. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Todd. Hi, Todd. Ah, don't hit me. Hit you? When have I ever hit you? Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Mrs. Jules, I'd like to nominate someone for class president. Who? Myra. What are you doing? I am this close to becoming class president. Yeah, but you're lying to everyone. You're lying to me, and you're lying to yourself. That's a bad thing? Sorry, but you promised to bring Myron back. I'm just helping you out. No, Normie says Myron's not interested. Oh, really? Well, there's one thing I know Myron can never resist, and that's a class election. So let the debate begin. Todd. Now, I don't want the school moved either, but if we really want to protest, we have to work together. Yeah! Everyone, Everyone protest! Let's try something simpler, like a boycott. When people are upset about something, they protest by staying away from it. Then we should... <gasps> boycott class? Yeah! Let's boycott class! Yay! Okay, okay everyone, everyone, let's, let's meet in class, class for the, the boycott, boycott of class! Yay! Wait! You can't go to class if you're boycotting class. <sighs> I say, love, how about a spot of tea and a scone? Oh, I say frighteningly good. Pip, pip. Oh, do be a dear and pass me the sugar bowl, please. But why, love? You're sweet enough already. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it! I knew there had to be an elevator around here somewhere. Now this makes sense. No more 30 flights of stairs every day. From now on, I'm taking the elevator. Huh? What? Maybe I pushed the wrong button. There must be some way to get this thing to go up. Think wayside. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go! Phew! Just made it to the bathroom in time. Wait a sec. Principal Kidswater? What? 344 South Fairview? What are you doing in here? This is an elevator, not a bathroom. And it's gonna take us to the 30th floor. Elevator? Hey, open up, you stupid gulak! Okay, here's my oral report, delivered without speaking. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Face it, Mauricia. I'd rather do anything than be your boyfriend. Would you kiss a dead rat? Yes, anything. Would you live in Antarctica? Yes. Would you eat Miss Mush's mushroom surprise? Yes. What? Because he's gone mad. Cool. You'd actually eat Miss Mush's mushroom surprise? Um, yeah. Oh, yeah? Well, prove it. Eat it. Okay, I will. Fine. Right now. Let's go. Todd, all I wanted was to sit next to you. You know, you could have just asked. Really? Then, can I sit next to you? Well, there's no seat here, but I'll sit with you at lunch if you want. Whoa! Awesome! How about in the playground, too? And on the bus? And even when we're not at school? Well, uh, yeah. What about in high school and college? Can I sit next to you at your first job? And when you're not eight years old, can I sit beside you then, even if you're old and stinky? Todd, you look so lonely all alone in that lonely raft. Wouldn't it be nice to have some company? Um, I'll be okay. Ah, finally, the last one on the list. Vacuum the schoolyard. Oh, principal for the day, dude. You're almost done the entire list. Yep, working on the last one. As a matter of fact, I've even improved on a few things. Observe. <whistles> yeah, nice touch with the cows. You know what? It's not that hard running this school. I don't know what the big deal is with kids swatter. Well, Todd, you have done more in one day than Kidswater does all year. But still, there is a reason he runs this place. Although sometimes it's hard to remember what that reason is. Reminds me of the time I... <laughs> Gotta get that pink paper back in there. Ah! <laughs> Hi, Principal Todd. I got sent to your office again for passing a love note, which may or may not be about you. Just what I need. Give me that love note. Ooh, which one? All of them. Oh, Todd, I'm so excited. You're finally reading the most secret things I've ever written about you. <clears throat> it's time you knew how I feel, Todd. Let love rain down on us. Uh, this isn't working. You're telling me this relationship really isn't working. Janella, put the 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 Janella. This is Jules. Todd pulled my ponytail. No, I didn't. We're on our way! We're on our way! We're wayside! Is that supposed to be me? Oh, no. 
Oh, of course not, Todd. That's our new school mascot, Todd. Big Head Todd inspires me so. Give me a W! W! Give me a Z! Z! Give me a 7! Seven. 7! What's it spell? Wayside! Hey, Dana. Let me guess. You're a librarian, right? Uh-uh-uh. A Dewey Decimal Technician. Great spring dance, huh? Yeah, but shouldn't we have the costume party at Halloween instead? Halloween? But that's when we celebrate the arrival of spring! Yeah, Todd, don't you know anything? Ah, now I'm ready for the costume party. Are you supposed to be a car dashboard? Yes! And the best part is, I've got driver's side airbags to protect myself from any sudden impacts. What kind of sudden impacts? <clears throat> Hi, Todd. Mauricia, need some company? Thanks, Todd. I always knew you were slow. Oh, uh, I mean, nice. Thanks. And I'm not that slow. Yes, you are. Just look at you. Mauricia, who cares who's slower, fast, or first, or last? I do! I do! I do! I do! Now just watch as I beat you to the top! 